Dzień dobry Polska. Today I'm getting my COVID vaccination and I'm a bit scared, but I have already had COVID, so I don't know and I don't think it's gonna be worse than that. But I really hope they speak English because otherwise I'm gonna be really scared. But wish me luck and I think I have to be there in 15 minutes and it's not so close to where I live, so let's get ready. I'm so late, like really late that I even forgot my, my jacket and it's like 10 degrees and there's a big problem like in order to get vaccinated you need to have your uh, ID card, your Polish ID card where it shows your ID number and I lost it, I cannot find it at all. I hope that that's not going to be an issue and they will allow me to get vaccinated so fingers crossed. Hold on, you don't have to wear face mask anymore so like it's Everything is back to normal because everybody is getting vaccinated and it's for free. And it was so easy to, to sign up. I just had to call, uh, give them my ID number and they just gave me, gave me a date. And, uh, and that was it. Um, I mean, it was a bit complicated because most of the people don't speak English, but it was fine. there I had to take like an electric scooter because I'm really late I have like 30 minutes and uh, I'm a bit scared because I don't have my um, I don't have my residence permit and you really need that in order to to get vaccinated but I hope they don't mind I have like a copy um, I'm actually renewing it so they took it away from me the old one um, and I'm also a bit scared, like every time that I have to go to the hospital in Poland, I get a bit scared because I haven't had like the nicest experiences here in Poland at the hospital. And I really hope they speak English. And I heard, I mean, so many of my friends, they are very scared about getting vaccinated. And I, I am too, but I just, I don't say it so they don't get scared as well. And I hear that you have to wait like 15 minutes after you get vaccinated just in case. So to see if there are any side effects, but I don't know, I'm almost there. And it's really cool because it was it's, it's for free as long as you live in Poland and if you have a, like a temporary residence permit or just a, or a permanent, you can get it for free and you can choose whichever vaccine you, can, you, you want to get. Like I chose Pfizer, but you can just get any you wish. I can already see people coming to get vaccinated. There's like a, a temporary place that they uh, put up in order to get people vaccinated. And as I said, you can choose whichever vaccine you want to get. It just depends. Uh, for example, if you choose Pfizer, it would take a bit longer to get the appointment because lots of people want to get that one. But if you want to get the one that is called AstraZeneca or something like that, that will get they will give it to you like in one day but when I called, they gave it to me for like the next two weeks, which is really good. And I don't know how it's gonna go. I will try to record as much as I can, but I don't know if they will allow me to do so. Um, but let's see, I think they will. I mean, everybody is recording, so I don't know. I heard that there are some side effects, some people, they had fever and stuff, but I have already had COVID, so I don't think it's gonna be worse than that. And I don't hope I don't get any of those side effects because actually I will just have to get vaccinated. It's gonna take like 15, 20 minutes. And then I will just have to go back to work because I start at 8 a.m. But I, I, I said that I was gonna get vaccinated. So I'm here, like I'm literally actually here and there's people like in the queue, I'm gonna show you. I'm not scared, but also excited, but I, don't, I think I'm scared because I'm scared that they won't speak Polish, but I'm excited that after this, I'm gonna feel more like normal, you know, like safer, even though I have already had COVID, but that doesn't mean anything. 
so I'm lost. I cannot find the place where I'm supposed to get vaccinated, but let's keep trying. I finally got vaccinated and as I was saying, I was very scared that they wouldn't speak English and I had to like wait in the line and I thought it was very late, it was almost like 8.20 and I didn't know that my appointment was at 8.05 so I was just waiting there and they were speaking Polish, I didn't know what to do so I was just very embarrassed to ask but I just went to this girl and I asked her like hey I'm sorry but like what do we have to do and she told me you are late, you should go now and I went there and uh, she helped me a lot so if you're watching this I don't think you will but thank you so much you helped me so much and uh, I had to fill in the form and one guy translated everything but I still like, had to use uh, Google Translator because I didn't understand anything the form was in Polish and then I just had to wait in line and the thing is that you have to go to like this front desk and get registered but they don't speak English and I didn't know what to do I just gave them like my um, my passport and everything and then they were calling by numbers and numbers in Polish are so difficult so I was so scared I was like fuck like I, I don't know what my number is I had 67 so I had literally had to go on Google Translator and write 67 and I had to listen uh, the pronunciation because uh, I, I don't know how to say that but then they called me and I was like is that my number or something so I went to the guy and he was like tac tac which means yes and then they they took me somewhere else they took my papers i was like what's going on but then they they made me wait and then i because they didn't speak english so they made me wait and i was just seeing how um everyone was getting vaccinated because they were waiting for the nurse who could uh, speak english so they could translate everything for me so they were really nice and then I asked her like can I record it and she was like yeah of course you can just do whatever and it literally took like five seconds like that she put the the vaccine she, she gave me the shot and then she was like yeah you can just go and I was like great so okay. shout out to Poland actually it was for free they were really nice I was very scared but yeah so I'm already at home and it's been like an hour and I literally don't feel anything um, I feel completely fine. I've heard that some people feel dizzy or like they have fever and stuff, but maybe later, I don't know. If anything, I will maybe make a second video telling you if I had any side effects, but so far so good. So, see you.